this is technically Richmond neighborhood, and we're on the uh, Lincoln Street Greenway, about uh, 10 blocks from Mount Tabor Park. So we get a lot of folks who are jogging and walking their dogs and seeing a lot of families out. I think it's a new message. I just put up a little message way so that people could just write down their thoughts and feelings. Any little thing that makes me connected to a stranger that I don't even know, I walk by their house and I, you know, spread some kind of connection is what keeps us more health, as healthy as we can given everything. I'm Sharon. Nice to meet you. <laughs> it's good, you know, you see stuff written all over and it, it does make you feel good about your community. We need that. Yeah. <laughs> My name's Sharon Kirkaby. Yeah, that is very cool. I thought about putting a message about what to write, but I just, I thought I'd just leave it open. I think it's a great idea. I have a poetry box, and so I thought that people could just write messages as they were going back and forth. That was a really cool idea. That's awesome. Thank you for the message. As hard as this is, Big letters, so yeah, you got it. As inconvenient as it may be, I think it's one of those things that really helps ground us. I think it's a nice sign. What do you need to do to stay safe these days? Stay home. And it's a nice message because we're feeling excluded from being close to one another these days, and this sort of makes us reminds us to think of others as well as you know doing our part to stay um, safe and not contaminate other people with potential sickness. It saves lives, poetry does. In your darkest times, you can write a poem. Peace and love. Absolutely, yeah, it's stuff like that that carries us through. And so people don't have to write poems here, they can write anything they want. I know it's a really stressful time for everybody. I like it. Yeah, very good idea. Yeah. It can be cathartic. Yeah, I love it. We're checking in on people when we didn't check in on them before. Um, we're introducing ourselves to people that we've seen, but we've never maybe said hello. Uh, you can still have fun. <laughs> yeah, then it would just be like a little way to connect. <laughs> so we like it. Yeah. Kindness yeah. is contagious. You can't see it now, but they wrote, they wrote thank you here, which I thought was really sweet. Eventually, we'll get to the other side of this. And I mean, that's my perspective anyway. We just want people to remember that, that this is just as contagious as anything else. And right now everybody needs a little bit of kindness because it goes a long way. So yeah. We're trying to stay hopeful. Things still happen. Girls turn 10 years old. We still have time together. I keep telling my husband, who's a physician actually, um, that this is our chance to take this as an opportunity and a learning experience, um, even though it's hard a lot of good can come from it.